I, I gotta tell you a story. It starts in 2017. Back in 2017 and... Here's the thing. When you are low, when you can't afford dinner or when you can't afford a parking ticket, you're at a certain stage in your life. You're at a certain stage if you're, you know, I really don't care who you are. It's a shitty stage. But what happens is you're like, you put things off. You put things off like parking tickets. You put things off like getting your car fixed. You put things off like getting a new tire so you get a spare shitty tire. You put things off like parking tickets. I'm just starting to come up a little bit. I'm talking like a little bit. And I don't even know what come up means when I say it. I just know I'm making more money than I was a year ago and it feels good. But I made some mistakes. Like parking tickets. And I hate to say it, it's not fun, it's not cool, but this is what happened yesterday. Getting out of a pretty good meeting, walking outside of Richland Library, I see a tow truck. I'm telling you, I'm just getting ahead, y'all. I'm just getting ahead. Barely. Go up to my car. I can't move my car unless I pay $350 worth of parking tickets. 11 since last year. It's one of those things I was like, ah, I'm gonna get that, ah, ah, I'm gonna get that. Now as soon as I get ahead, as soon as I get ahead a little bit, $350. Couldn't leave without paying. Drop me down. Drain me for the rest of the day. Like, are you kidding me? Just pay your fucking parking ticket. It's a fucking metaphor, man. Take care of your shit. I had $8 to pay the ticket. I could have put a dollar in to pay for it. Yeah, it sucks. Could have. Pay your parking. Text mom, hope you have an amazing day. Ready to send it? Yes. There it goes.